Hi friends, as you guys can see, we have Lucy here as our beautiful model today and she's wearing this really glamorous, sparkly events look. It's great for formals, Christmas parties or even New Year's because it's so sparkly. So if you guys are interested in this look, please keep watching. So we're first starting off with some Bourjois Healthy Mix Serum Foundation and this shade is actually the lightest shade. It's a bit light for Lucy but um, it will oxidize in a bit, so it should be fine. Going with concealer, we're going to conceal her under eye circles. And I'm just looking, it doesn't look like she has that much of pimples at the moment, so we're just going to focus on the under eyes. Using some highlighter, we're going to highlight Lucy's cheekbones and also brow bones. Your eyebrows look like elf eyebrows. They're so thick. I remember the the elf king. Oh, his, his eyebrows, eyebrows are like his hair. His eyebrows are like so noticeable. How can you not notice them? They're like hair. caterpillars on his face. Finishing off with some powder, we're going to use the cameo under Lucy's eyes. So this Chanel Le Beige on the outer C of Lucy's face. And this Chanel Vita Lumiere powder foundation for Lucy's T-zone which is a bit oily and a bit on her cheeks to highlight the areas. To finish off Lucy's face we're going to go with contour and highlight or additional highlight so we're going to use the contour in the Charlotte Tilbury Film Star Bronze and Glow, the bronze side. Even though Lucy has that highlight underneath the foundation, I still want to add additional highlight so it gives more light. Very last thing for the cheeks is a blush and I'm using my Tarte Amazonian in Blissful. This is my blush that I go to when I can't think of anything because this blush typically goes with any look. And you'll realise I'm using the same brush for all of the face. I'm currently loving this little um, Real Techniques contour brush. So versatile for all of the face. The last thing for the face is the brows and as you guys can see Lucy has very luscious brows. We're just watching The Hobbit and she looks like she has elvish eyebrows. To start off with the eyes, we're going to go in with my trusted NARS eyeshadow primer. Going with my favourite eyeshadow quad, this is the Tom Ford Orchid Haze. And with the lightest shade, applying it all over the Lucy's eyelid. And then with this mauve shade, we're going to apply it to the outer half as a blending. defines the outer corners. For layering, I'm going to go with this taupey shade and we're going to layer on top of that mauve shade. And this will just intensify the colour. Using the little brush in the palette, and I'm going to go in with the darker shade, we're going to apply on the very outer corners of Lucy's lash line. And I'm going to clean my brush off with a tissue, just in circular motions. And we're going to use this to blend everything out, to make sure the outer doesn't have any harsh lines so blend the mauve and the lightest shade together to finish off Lucy's eyelid space we're going to go in with another Tom Ford quad and this is their quad in Seductive Rose 
and we're going to be using this pink glittery shade all over the um, the lattice shade that we applied on top. For Lucy's lower lash line, I'm going with this Max Factor Excess Shimmer and this shade is in crystal and we're applying this on the inner lower lash line. The final colour we're going to use is Toasted by The Naked Palette and using MAC's 239 brush, we're going to apply this to the outer lower, look up, the outer lower lash line. Is it 239 or 339? 239. We're going to tie line with a black eyeliner on Lucy's upper lash oh, line. Oh, she's going to hurt her with this. Yeah, let, yeah. Me, let me brace myself. <laughs> To brighten Lucy's lower lash line, we're going to go in with a nude eyeliner and just brim her waterline. I got it, I got it. Yeah, yeah, that's another one. Right. We're going to use a liquid liner to line Lucy's upper lash line and creating a little wing on the end. As you guys can see, I've got some eyeliner on Lucy's lower lash line there, so I'm just going with a um, with some of our foundation and also a Q-tip. To finish off Lucy's eyes, we're going to curl her lashes and then apply two of my favourite mascaras at the moment. The very last touches, we're going to add in some very natural lashes and these just flare out on the end. For Lucy's lip today, we're going to go in with this really beautiful berry colour. Very final touches, we're going to add some of the highlight from the Tom Ford palette. Just on the very centre. So friends, this is the finished look for today. As you can see, it's very glamorous and sparkly. And thank you so much for Lucy for being our model today. She was very cooperative. And as you guys can see, she's very beautiful. And don't forget to like and subscribe below if you like this look. And please comment down below if you have any questions. And until next time, bye.